I'm standing in the chancel. Now, if we were in the court of the Emperor Constantine, what you would see behind me would be his ministers, his advisors. However, we're in a cathedral, and the chancel in a cathedral houses the altar and the choir and the organ console. That, by the way, is just the console. It is not the organ. The organ is a room to my left filled with pipes, not the fancy decorative pipes you see on the wall behind me. The organ at the cathedral is one of the 26 pipe organs in the city of Winnipeg, which makes it something of an organist's paradise. It's also a cassavant, hand-built in Quebec. My name is Sam, and I'm the music director here at St. John's Cathedral, and I'd like to talk a little bit about the organ. It was purchased in 1927 for the amount of $8,485. The money was raised by the St. John's Cathedral Ladies' Aid. To replace the organ now would be nearly a million dollars. This organ has 39 stops and well over a thousand pipes. I've got three keyboards to work with. This one is called the Great Keyboard, which is the primary one that gets used for hymn playing. The keyboard above it is the Swell Keyboard, and it's equipped with a box that has shutters so that I can control the dynamic. The bottom keyboard is the choir keyboard, which is usually used for accompanying choral pieces. It had a box with shutters as well, but those were removed in order to improve the sound. <laughs> 